I'm delighted that this is an opportunity for us to launch our new uh, center on technology, robotics, AI, and the law trail. We hope that the center will be both a center of gravity and a platform. A center of gravity in that it will bring together people from around the world, leading scholars on the legal, ethical, policy, philosophical and regulatory questions associated with the use and development of information technology in general and AI, data analytics and robotics in particular. It's an area that the government looks at very closely, mainly because we would be left behind if we did not embrace the changes that were brought about by technology. Uh, trail, robotics, AI, technology is something that I think is right upon us at our doorstep. If we don't look at the implications that technology has, the changes that we need to make to our laws, to our regulation, to our regime, and I think this will gallop ahead of us and we'll lose control of it. So therefore the launch of this centre today is indeed very timely. The NUS Centre for Trail has certainly an important role to play in many of the areas I've outlined and perhaps even more. The ability of trail to research, to promote your learning, to adapt them to the practical world, to give thought leadership in the field of law, technology, robotics, AI, and how the landscape, the regulatory landscape in particular, should operate would be something that we welcome. I'm sure the centre will excel and become a leading think tank in this field. Technology always is one step ahead of legal developments and it has the potential to bring about so many benefits and advancements to society. Yet it also has the potential for misuse and abuse. Through the collective efforts of our really stellar team of scholars and researchers from not just the law school but also the School of Computing and the Lee Kuan Yew School of Public Policy and all the other schools in NUS as well as from our various affiliates and research institutions, we hope to make a positive contribution towards this area of the law by way of our exam examination of the legal, ethical, policy, philosophical and regulatory questions surrounding these, these issues, hopefully with a view to ensuring that the fourth industrial revolution, this technological revolution that we have, will be able to bring us the maximum benefit to society. And of course, we hope you can join all of us on this trailblazing journey.